Hey everyone, it's me, Arthur Cade, and I've got the gentlemen of comic book men joining me behind the velvet rope. Brand new season, season five coming to AMC, so check it out. Hey everyone, it's me, Arthur Cade, and the only guy who is not a comic book man here is me, because I'm here with the comic book men. Guys, congratulations, New York Comic Con. It's like nuts here. You guys are in season five of this show. How crazy is it to just know you're coming back? Five seasons in TV is an eternity. Crazy, right? Yeah, it's pretty insane. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And yet it seemed to, fl it, it's flown by. So, you know, let, let's hope for another five seasons. It's, it's fine. A, a lot of our favorite shows never made it this far, so. So, so we're better than them. So we're better than them. We're totally better. We're, right. we're, we're better than Firefly. We're better than Freaks and Geeks. We're better than all those shows, man. Ming Chen's better than Lindsay Wagner. I like that. I like that comparison. <laughs> when you guys look at the the fan phenomenon that's happened around just the comic book culture and how people have attached to this, talk to me about it because it's crazy. I mean, I was just seeing Kevin Smith here. I'm like, I remember the Jay and Silent Bob movies, and to still think that this stuff is still popular, it's crazy, right? Uh, I. Yeah, insane. Didn't I just say that? Yes. Um, it's going to be your answer for okay, my, now. It's insane. Um, oh, so I'm Crazy Eddie now. Great, <laughs> thanks. Um, no, I think that, um, I think I said this once before that, you know, pop culture uh, started out like underground. Now it's just culture. People, you know, uh, a lot of the movies you see out there are all comic book based. And it's been going on for years and nobody knew it. Speaking of culture, Secret Stash is like its own culture. Do, like, I remember growing up, that was like a destination. Is it still, just seeing from the show, it seems like it's still a destination. It's still a destination with everything? Uh, yeah, people from all over the world every day are coming to the stash, you know. That ha that was before the show. Uh, after the show, it, it's just, uh, you know, it's just growing even more, you know. Would you like to say crazy? Yeah. It's insane. It's insane. <laughs> every answer must begin with insane. <laughs> You know we're going to have to somehow cut that into a of meme course. and it's going to be like, it's insane every five seconds in the interview. <laughs> How's it changed your lives being on that show? Uh, I mean, we get, we get invited here. We're behind the velvet rope now. I mean, oh, figured. Where is that velvet it's rope? Insane. Uh, yeah, it's insane. It's insane. Yeah. I mean, I figuratively and literally, you know, we get to, we get to do this behind the scenes now. It's, it's a lot of fun. Whereas before, we just go to the con and, you know, wait in line like everyone else. So. I love all the terms, the stash, so the con. I'm so an outsider. <laughs> Again, we're better than everybody. Again, we're better than everybody. Yes. So the lessons we've learned today, it's insane and we're better than other people. I love it. When you guys look around, obviously movies, you just mentioned it. It's insane. <laughs> I give up. Booyah! <laughs> it is insane to see. We see the Avengers. We see the comic book evolution. What do you guys think of all that when you see what's happening? I think it's. Uh, I think everybody else is catching up with us. We've known it for years that this stuff is is absolutely amazing. I can't take you seriously. So you get in, start with it, saying, <laughs> "Yeah, Mike, why didn't they listen to you way back then? We were ahead of our time. They did didn't." Did you listen guys to know you. though? Like, did you have a feeling like, "Hey, people are going to take absolutely on to this?" Absolutely not. Stuff? No way. We, we just like what we, we liked. We would have invested in Marvel when it was almost oh, yeah. uh, when it was almost dead if we had known it would yeah. this would have happened. Yeah. You know? <laughs> what are some of your favorites? I'm always curious. You're immersed in this. Who are your favorites? Of what the, Go, the comic movies? books and, and the superheroes? Comic books, um, you know, Avengers, Justice League, uh, Walking Dead. Huge, huge fan of them. Teen Titans, Spawn. And I'm a big Star Wars fan. After this is all over, I'm going to go jump in line, wait for another two months. I just interviewed Donald Gleason. I was in Oscar Isaac. I was freaking the F out because I'm me too. Uh, I'm not much into comics, but I'm reading Why the Last Man right now. And I guess that's, what, 10 years behind the curve, but still. <laughs> Better late I, than never. Yeah, right? I like it. Sure, listen to the Mike's Zapsy <laughs> bandwagon. <laughs> Nicely done, Brian. Like you're insane for not listening <laughs> yeah, to me. Yeah, you're insane. You're crazy. <laughs> One guy who was out of the truck. <laughs> Let's <laughs> One guy who was out of the trend was Kevin Smith. Talk to me about relationship with Kevin because he is such an integral part of all of your lives. Oh, I mean, I, from the moment I, I met Kevin, you know, in the 80s, um, it's just been, uh, you know, he's given me uh, opportunities to do things I never would have dreamed uh, I would be doing. Um, some I enjoy, some I don't. Um, but it doesn't this matter. This should be one. <laughs> brutal. <laughs> <laughs> wow. No, I'm never going to look. Another meme coming. Yeah. What about for you guys? Yeah, I would say the same as well. Like, we, we grew up in a town that, like, 
didn't really push you towards, you know, trying anything other than, like, basically it was like, you're going to work at the mill or you're going to, like, die in a crossfire at the <laughs> market. <laughs> mill was what? there in Highland. Yeah, the metaphorical <laughs> mill. <laughs> what? What? <That's laughs> <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what did the coal mine shut down? And now you have to work in the middle. Like, we didn't grow up in 1940s <laughs> in middle America. <laughs> what, I'm, what I'm saying is, you you weren't like at least in my family anyway. Maybe yours were different. My <laughs> avoiding crossfires. I, I wasn't even urged towards college, let alone like you know trying anything Seriously. big and. With Kevin, like Kevin always had big dreams, and he sort of took you along for that. Otherwise, you'd probably have a nor like a normal job. I have no job at all now, aside from being on TV. So it's worked out well. And avoiding the crossfires. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> I'm in tears right now. Season five. What can people expect? Crossfires. Cross uh, Lindsay no, no workers. Lindsay <laughs> Wagner. Uh, insanity. I can I can promise you insanity. <laughs> A che Chewbacca appearance? Really? Yeah, not yes, yeah. any Chewbacca, the Chewbacca, Peter Mayhew. Get out of here. Yeah, and and four taggers on. Do you guys freak out when that stuff happens? Like I, I still, I'm like I'm. I consider myself so privileged to be able to do this and to meet so many awesome people. When you get to meet people like that, that like you're fans of, what's your reaction? Uh, yeah, try to keep it in on the inside. You know, try not to drool all over them too much, but it ends up happening anyways. So. It's, it. it's fun. I mean, you know, Peter Mayhew, it's, it's a, a guy who grew up in a, uh, watching the Wookiee costume when I was four. I never thought I'd meet him like 30, 40 years later. So. But also carries throughout the rest of the crew. Like everybody gets excited. Yeah. So the energy gets a little bit higher on the, on, the, on the show too, you know. Did you ever imagine five seasons on TV? Like, right? Seriously, weird, right? We were, we were, uh, we were given a six episode to begin with, right? Yeah. So we weren't even sure we would get all the way to six. Let, let alone five seasons. We don't even know if we would get five episodes before yeah. getting canceled. So it's, it's I cool. I thought I'd be in the middle right now. So <laughs> <laughs> avoiding process. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm stunned. <laughs> <laughs> like Tupac style. Yeah, like, right, yeah. Congratulations, guys. Really great Thank stuff.